Welcome to the photographic and digital imaging video for subject selection. Photographic and digital imaging is a content indoors course. If you are a student who is imaginative, artistic and loves to take photographs, then this may be the course for you. You will have the opportunity to develop your knowledge and skills through the art making of photographs, digital imaging, filmmaking and or other timed based works. You will also learn about different artists, photographers, filmmakers and investigate how they may influence your art making practice. The units of works that you will be studying will be based on the three fields of wet photography, video and digital imaging. You are required to make a photographic and or digital image work for each of the units studied. You are also required to keep a diary, also known as an art book. This will contain all your ideas, experimentation, planning for your photographic and digital imaging works. Throughout this course, you will be required to develop a portfolio showcasing your completed works. 70% of this course is spent on art making, where students learn photographic and digital media skills to create artworks in the form of wet photography, video, digital imaging. You will learn about the history of photography, create photographs without using a camera, learn to use an SLR camera and process your film, develop black and white photographs in the darkroom. Then we move on to learning how to use a digital SLR camera to take digital photographs, where we will manipulate and create computer generated works using computer software such as Adobe Photoshop, Premiere and Lightroom. The other 30% is based on theory. Here, students will learn about different photographic and digital artists and their works and see how they may influence their own art making practice. The fees for this subject is $50. This will cover the cost of all materials required to create your artworks. Other things you will need for this subject are a photographic and digital media journal, also known as an art book, a plastic sleeve folder where you'll be able to keep your test strips, negatives and photographs in, some writing equipment, 2B, 4B pencil, scissors and glue. Exclusions. Projects developed for assessment in one subject are not to be used either in full or in part for assessments in another subject. What this means? This means, take for instance, you are studying visual arts and photographic and digital media. You can't submit a photograph that you have made in the photographic and digital media course for an assessment task in your visual arts course. There is also no external examination at the end of year 12 for this course. The study of photography, video and digital imaging provides students with knowledge, understanding and skills that form a valuable foundation for a range of courses at university and other tertiary institutions. It also prepares students for employment. Listed here below are some industries related to photography, video and digital imaging. We look forward to seeing you in our photographic, video and digital imaging course next year.